Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here, and today I'm gonna be showing you how to shift the pitch of your voice. Yes, that is what I'm gonna be showing you today. It's a pretty fun effect, and it's very, very easy to pull off, so let's get started. So, all we need to do is have an audio clip ready to go. And in this situation, what I did is I just used a little voiceover record. You can set up your mic, I have a tutorial on that, um, and just record your voice straight into Premiere Pro. Once your voice is in Premiere Pro in any way, shape, or form, we can just begin the effect. All we need to do is go into Effects, Let's go down to Pitch Shifter. So if we search Pitch up here, we don't want the obsolete one. Um, I'm running version 13, which is CC 2019. Uh, it obsoleted, I think, two or three years ago. So any newer version should have Pitch Shifter, and any older version should have the old Pitch Shifter. Anyway, we're going to take that Pitch Shifter, and we're going to drag it onto our footage just like so. You'll see that it appears up here in the effect controls. And so now we have the pitch shifter to begin manipulating. If we want to fine tune the pitch shifter, we go ahead and we click that edit key. We want to go ahead and go down to here and change it to high precision. We want the precision to be high. No matter how you do this, you always want to come in here and switch that to high precision. We're then going to go up into the semitones and synths, and the semitones are basically just 100s, while the synths are 0 to 100. So this right here would be 200 this would be 230. So it's just two different sliders so that we can get more fine-tuned with the pitch shifting. And you'll notice that whenever we change this, we're actually changing the ratio down here as well. And that is important for whenever we want to make it an animation. I'll talk about that in a second. So if we bring it up to here and we play back that audio. And today I'm gonna be showing you. You can hear that it's a very, very high pitch sound. If we bring it down low. You how to shift the pitch. I get a very deep, bassy voice to my my sound. So we can go ahead and we can change that and quickly shift our pitches up and down. It's that simple. Now, if we want to animate that, that's where that ratio comes into play. If we go to individual parameters, you'll see that transpose ratio. That's what that ratio is. And if we animate this over time, we can actually make it go up to make our, our voice high pitched. So we go ahead and we click the pitch shifter, go to individual parameters, drop down the arrow, go to transpose ratio, turn on the toggle animation wherever you want the animation to begin move forward a little while, and then go ahead and drag it up or down. Now you'll notice this isn't actually a draggable one, so we have to drop this down and use the slider here. So we'll slide this up to maybe 1.12. You'll only go too far because the ratio is a little bit different than the semitones and synths. If we go up to like, you'll see that this only goes up to two, and that's maximum. So anywhere around 1.2, 1 point, or uh, 0.8 will be fine. Then we bring this back down over here, and now we have an animation. Hey, what's up, everybody? Adobe Masters here. And today, I'm going to be showing you how to shift the pitch of your voice. Just like so. And now we can actually have a lot of fun with the pitch. But that is it. It's a very, very simple tutorial. All you need to do is that pitch shifter. Just understand the parameters in there. Grab that ratio. You can do whatever you want with it. Thanks, everyone, for joining me. If you have any questions or comments, go ahead and throw them in the comment section below. On our website at adobemasters.net. If you want to see more videos similar to this one, I make a video every other day, or at least I try to. So go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Thanks, everyone, for joining me. And until next time, see ya.